hello automation and we are lovers welcome back to kt sessions and in today's session we are going to explore the concept of uh, global values in automation anywhere a360 so when we go to our control room and uh, here in uh, left hand side uh, we can see the menus and uh, in manage we can see this option of global values so when we click on it we, we can see the list of glo uh, list of global values here as of now there are no global value so when we create it when we create one it will uh, automatically appear here so first understand what is the global value and why do we use this value so if i talk about uh, definition of the global value so we can say global values enable users to reuse identical values between bots instead of creating new variable for each bot so for example if there is any value which is common in all the bots and uh, you want to use this uh, value in uh, your bo all the bots so you need to create a variable in all of the bots so instead of creating a variable in all of the bots we can create a global val variable or global value and uh, we can use this global value in uh, our uh, all the bots so if we want to change the value in future so we need to just change the value of that global uh, value or the global variable instead of changing the value in all the bots if we are using a local variable then we need to lo uh, open all the bots and then we need to update the value of local variable so instead of doing that we can just update the value in the global value or the global variable so there are a lot of things which we can uh, save in our uh, global values like a uh, path of the application or the folder or the drives so for example if we are working in dev environment so we have a specific drive so which uh, which we are using in our uh, all the boards or in a uh, lot of boards so we can save that path similarly if you uh it could be different in uh, test environment so if we use global variable so in test we can give the value as uh, the shade drive path of the test and in uh, dev we can give the dev shade drive path similarly if you are using any application and the path of the application we can save in this value uh, global variables so there can be lot of variables which are common in a uh, lot of bots so we can create our uh, global vari values and save those variables now who can create this uh, global values so a user with the aae admin role or view and manage global value permission can configure a global value using a tenant scope value this enable enables other automation a360 users to either use tenant scope or override to user scope values in their bots and data type of the global value can be date time number string boolean and uh, user group so for creating a global value so if we want to create a global value we will go to this uh, tab which i have shown you so here we can click on this plus icon so we will get this type of uh, form or the uh, form which uh, in which we need to enter some values okay okay so here we can give the name of the global value and the description will be optional and here we can select the data type and here we can give the value of this variable so if we are saving the path of the very path of any shared drive or any folder or the path of any application or anything so we can give that path here and the scope of this global value so we can select the scope of the very value also uh, can't be changed the default value will be used for everyone so uh, no one can change this value and uh, the second scope is can be changed the default value will be used unless the username running the bot has changed the value so if you want to change the value you can change it also uh, if you have selected this uh, scope can be changed otherwise if you have selected this can't be changed so you 
you or any other user won't be able to uh, update the value of this variable okay so for example uh, in some of our uh, boards uh, if we are using the value of uh, like pi so that is constant uh, in all the boards or if you are using the value of uh, some another constant so we can use this type of uh, global value so now we have created this variable now how can we use this variable or the global value in our task board so let me go to this task board and uh, for example i have uh, created a a string type of global value so i will uh, start string here and here i will take the assign action of string and here we need to assign the value so i will click on this uh, insert a value drop down and here you will get an option of global value uh, here we have option to of variable so in enterprise edition you will get the option to add global value so you can click on that and then you can select the variable name so as soon as you click on that global value uh, tab then uh, this drop down will uh, show you the list of the of uh, global values so you can click on that and you can click on yes insert so it that will uh, insert the value of uh, global variable so you can uh, assign the value of uh, global uh, variable to your uh, local variable and you can use that value in your program or in your task board so this is how you can create a global value and use in your program so do let me know if you have any doubt or any question uh, related to this uh, i will help you on that uh, thank you guys for watching this video bye bye